Hello everyone, Ron here again. I'm going to show you a quick video on how to change some sounds on a beam or a switch when you're using Logic. So at the moment I have this sound on switch 5. You can see just down there it's coming up with green beside number 5. That's the sound of a hot air balloon, in case you're wondering. Uh, and to change that, so we go to switch 5, so that's highlighted. And then go over to the side here, to this bit where it says EXS24. Click on that in the middle, and that'll come up with this sort of crazy screen here. Just kind of ignore all this really. And then go up to this, where it says Hot Air Balloon 2, that's the sound that I have on this one. Click on that and it will give you a drop down menu. And you can kind of choose any sort of thing here. If you go to the bottom one, these are kind of sample sounds from GarageBand. And it's, there's loads and loads and loads and loads and loads. Look at that. There's some factory ones. I've got some other kind of settings going on here. So let's go to factory. And let's go down to pop strings. And let's go to arco strings. Let's click on that one. Now it should have changed. There we go. That's a kind of string sound there on that one. And then you can just close it. And that's it there. What I would make sure you do is then definitely make sure you go back and highlight Sound Beam Master again. Because if not, when you try and play two switches at once, it'll all just sound a bit crazy. So, make sure you click Sound Beam Master. And you've got that. So as a quick recap, this one, over to here, up to here, and down to whatever one you want. I'm going to put it mine back to my hot air balloon for now. There we go.